Hey there guys, it's me, Big Daddy T. And today I thought I'd take it back to the roots. One of my most viewed, if not the most viewed video on the channel. Cornetto Review 2, baby. So starting off, I think we got these in a multi pack, so the actual wrapping around the side is not complete. But this is chocolate and nut flavour. Chocolate and nut flavour. So let's, uh, let's just dig into it. Open up the tin foil. Oh, she's naughty. She is. She's feisty today. Bit of a bit of a difficult wrapper to open, but I think that's a Cornetto staple at this point. Peel this back. There we go. Oh, lovely! Just a little bit more. She won't rip. There we go, ladies and gents. The head of the beast is out. What was this again? Chocolate and nut. Let's see if it'll make me nut. That's cold. I've got sensitive teeth. Bugging me, silly. The nut is doing its job. It's doing it well. I... I, I can respect that. That is a good nut. That is a really good nut. Creamy nut. But chocolate flavour on the other hand. Whether it's just me, I'm not a massive fan of chocolate flavour, to be honest. Unless it's actual chocolate itself. Um, but the nuts are crunchy in my mouth. Some crunchy nuts in my mouth. And the creamy, the creamy nut is in my mouth as well, so that's nice. Uh, it's, it's, it's a bit more melted, so it's not as hardy as the um, the old peppermint one or the mint one, whatever it was back in the day. Uh, it's been 50 years since I've eaten a Cornetto. But yeah, um, let's move on to the next layer, which is the, the little chocolate around the cone. Mmm. Very nice. Not mostly cone there as well. As you can see. Normal design packaging. Yeah, again, I, I said in my last interview, interview with the Cornetto, um, I didn't like this. This this little break in design here. But I think they are made in China for cheap money. So maybe, maybe that's just how they come, I guess. I don't know. This packaging's really getting on my nerves, but the, the the comb has a lovely crunch, a lovely texture, and it almost melts in your mouth. A few little bits of debris left in the tongue, but other than that, lovely jubbly. There's a hard piece of chocolate there on the top. Unexpected. Welcome surprise. Hmm. Bit more cone action. I'm loving it. This one really meshes well together. Yeah, I I really enjoy this one. Now as you can see here, it's it's a bit of a it's a bit of a mid colour. You know, the colour's not over great. I prefer the green. But I think the corner makes up for it in itself. You know. Hmm. This is lovely. This makes me want to kick back and relax and, and sunbathe on top of a roof in the suburbs, like Malcolm in the Middle. A 
I'll tell you what, the actual ice cream like section itself, you can really sink your teeth into that. It's it's so fucking spider. So lovely and, and fluffy, but there's so much there, it's meaty, you can bite into it. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. Just like you, Princess Eugenie. Gorgeous. Thank you all. Arrivederci.